today we are going to talk about cleanliness and tidiness most of the time who is asked to be neat and tidy isn't it girls what do we say if we see a boy who is neat and tidy oh look at him he is so neat just like a girl so we are programmed to think that cleanliness and tidiness is a part and parcel of being a girl and being messy and untidy are characteristics of a boy now don't you think these are characteristics that should be adopted by everyone as humans we accept that however people in our society still believe that boys are born to be untidy and are not able to work in an orderly manner that a house needs a woman to manage and keep it in order look at this boys room for an example it is very untidy in contrast look at this girls room which is very neat even their mother would constantly say that boys are generally untidy from a young age we teach our girls to be clean neat and do things with patience and sensitivity but we don't give this teaching to our young boys then we should say men should also be concerned about cleanliness tidiness and their health this is especially true when learning how to do any work in an orderly manner to keep your surrounding environment clean it is also important to consume healthy food and lead a healthy life we must also understand that being clean neat and tidy or doing things in an orderly manner it's not subject to whether you are a girl or a boy these are things important to lead a good life also we have seen many who consume junk food on the side of the road on their way home from work become obese and struggle with illnesses such as diabetes high cholesterol levels in order to avoid this we must all take steps to lead a healthy life by being mindful of our health and well-being after all who wouldn't like a man who is clean and does things in an orderly manner you should also become a man that strives to be healthy clean and orderly